this is Nana, and today I'm do showing you my lineup. Now, right now, I actually considered I'm I'm starting to use Inferno Dragon again. Yes, multiple times it did say it was trash. Well, because it is. There's a creepy dude staring at me. Jonathan, stop staring at me. Creep. Why? Why? Just stop. No. You stare at me. I swear I'm gonna punch you one of these days. Anyways, here's my deck. It's uh, it lightning spells OP. I don't care what people say. That thing is OP. And perfect example. I mean, I haven't lost. I was saying the giant issue. I finally fixed it. Instead, I take the tombstone out, which kind of sucked, and put my inferno dragon in. I mean, I'm beating all types of people. I mean, dude, they are not getting through anymore. Oh yeah, especially this dude right here. It was really hilarious. Cause he also had like he had like a similar push push. And also right now I'm at my all time high twenty six thirteen. Which I'm excited. Cause I don't know where I just kept on winning and winning. And I wasn't re really winning with my tombstone. It's pretty weak, so I thought maybe I could replace it with my Inferno Dragon. Since it does the same freaking thing. It's good for attracting troops away. I don't exactly remember this battle. Pretty sure right here I do the push with a hog rider. Not 100%. Lightning mainly use it only if there's enough space where you can kill a few things. Like if there's multiple things and they add up more than more than uh, the elixir that you're using on the lightning. Like right there, I use it, but it stopped the push, which would have killed my tower. And right here, man, this is a perfect example why the arrows is great in this lineup. Right here, I'm pretty sure he uses, yeah, he uses the arrows. Oh, yeah. The only problem, bad problem with, with the Inferno Dragon, he's, he's, he has ADHD. Dude's got no focus at all. Anyways, guys, happy Thanksgiving. Um, I said I wanted to do it in double uploads, but that kind of was not a schedule. I planned too far ahead of the future. I don't know why. Right here, he got a little stupid. Well, that was a waste. I still got a few hits up. <laughs> I was waiting to see that lava hound. Man, it was going to be funny. So I just started on the opposite side. And you just play straight up offense. So I do the same thing. Go ahead. I, I just play straight up offense. I mean, what was the point in playing defense? Probably was going to take out my tower. And plus, I had already a great push going on. And he tells me right here, good game, because you know it's over. Did I hear? I used the lightning, I think. No. But that just shows the power of the Inferno Dragon. If someone, if it's at your tower, it, it, you're done for. I mean, that just shows the power. And I, I don't think I've lost, like, a single match in a long time. Oh, yeah, that was used. Oh, yeah. I'm showing you that deck, that born giant deck. It's pretty dirty, but I hate, I hate it. I, I just stopped using it. At one point, I decided that I wasn't going to use it in mid-battle, I would quit. This is my old deck, uh, running right here. It didn't seem to work very well, but with the Inferno Dragon, it complements the Lava Hound, and also when things are getting desperate, it can destroy giants, which I love, and I, if I cover for the Inferno Dragon, he will destroy pretty much any type of tank, including golems. He melts golems down. I mean, he makes the golem looks really stupid, which a lot of people are starting to use the golem deck. For example, right here, um, my friend Dragon the Legend is using using a golem deck. I mean, he can't beat me. Oh yeah, there's also this dude in a clan. His name is Noob, 
All, um, he has a level 2 miner, an ice wars and a lava hound, and he decides he's not going to use any of it for some particular reason. I don't know why. It's a great card. All of them are great cards right there, except for the Ice Wizard. Dude, that card is not very good at all. I played with it in my on my dad's second account, on Blue's second account, and it's not very good. Here's my second account. I used the Valkyrie on it. The Valkyrie is beast behind a Royal Giant. This is a Royal Giant cycle, like a almost a cycle deck. His, it is a decent elixir. It's not too expensive, but it's not really cheap. Oh yeah, and then there's a few other people, like my friend, his name is Cappy, uh, he's, he's in Builder's Workshop for some reason, I don't know why, he was really high, for a while he just kept on passing and passing and passing us, he's only been to Royal Arena like once, I think, yeah, he doesn't use the Royal Giant, which is a mistake, but whatever. You know why you pe- uh, mm. and then- this person right here, yeah, this person named Legion of Muertes, yeah, not very nice. She has a log. Log! Really? Really? Yep. Log is a douchebag. I'm a douchebag. Really, Mom? Mm hmm Legion of Muertes is my mom. So, Blue the Legend is my mom, too. What? No, my dad. She's using a dirty deck with the giant and royal giant. Double giant douchebag deck and a log, so she's a big douchebag. Douche. Anyways, Blue actually man managed to stay in the Legend League, and he also got a miner, which was I thought was pretty cool. And, and since the uh, last video, he's upgraded his uh, Mega Minion to level seven. His Ice Ice Golem's been level seven. He upgraded his Bowler and his Miner. Anyways, guys, um, I will show you another video and. Why this deck is a beast. And even beat a Royal Giant deck. No oh, okay. Sure, I guess I click share. And this guy, if after a while, just gave up. Of course, a three card, I'm gonna give up, but this goes to show that how people get angry when you use this deck. I give him a thumbs up because I'm, I'm like so happy because he's like, yes, I finally get a tank deck. I like people when I get a uh, tank decks because it's so easy. I don't know what happened to my Mega Minion there. I dropped the Mega Minion. We're right here. Look, the Royal Giant literally only gets like two shots up. And he wasted all that effort on it. Miss mistakes mistakes were made. I freaking hate the furnace though. When people use it, that card is the frustrating card. It frustrates the crap out of me. Right there, I kind of used it to tank up those hits. But that dark prince he has, dude, that thing hits like a truck. I like the dark prince. I think it's a really good card. Look, look at the damage. I mean, that's a beast. That's beast damage. That's why I always like them. Mine's level 3, so that's why he does a lot of damage. I think they should upgrade his damage on him, though, since... I mean, I do kind of understand why his damage isn't the highest, because... Then again, he does do splash attack. Right here, I get kind of desperate. That was a bad place he met. Eh. Gotta go with the flow. The flow was kill everything. I mean, it wasn't the worst push in the world. It could have gone worse. I mean, it did get some sm semi-chip in there. Which, better than nothing. Okay, do the ice cubes on the top of the other mountain move? That's where I just saw the ice cubes on it move. That's weird. Right here, you make your defense into offense. What I mean by that is when you get that, don't use it for offense. Like once you get your defense up, use it for offense. Because then that's when you have your best push right here. 
You're gonna use you wanna use the lightning spell to destroy all of that mess right there. And then this dude decides he's gonna wait it out, pretend he's all cool and stuff. <clears throat> wait for it. Wait for it. Pretending to be cool. Oh, he really wasn't. I thought he was trying to be all cool and wait till the last second. Oh, I really thought he was. I was hoping he wasn't gonna hit it. And, yep, he didn't get to it. I told him good game, but he laughed. He had a good laugh about it. Cappy says I suck. Shut up, man. You're not gonna become Sean. You don't believe in yourself. <laughs> oh, okay. That makes sense. Oh, Blue is actually using Sparky again? Oh, he's using all his legendary deck. He's done that before. It's hilarious. I mean, it doesn't. The deck sucks, but. <laughs> Why not? When you have a bunch of legendaries. Who cares? Wow. What a douche. What a douche. I'm calling him out right there. My, my family witness. My family witness is, is a douche. And somehow someone blew his winnie with the deck. Is this the deck he's actually using to go battle? Hold up. I need to see this real quick. This is live from Blue right now. Ugh. Stupid giant user. My friend's a stupid giant user. Stupid giant douchebag. Get it? A, a giant douchebag. Get it? A giant... <laughs> Come on! Come on, miner! Oh, what a douchebag move. Of course, blue with the rage. I want to see if they take the battle. One way to make someone battle you? So just say you scared. And they'll click on it so they don't look like they're scared. Yep. Works of magic. <laughs> With the old spammer. Tell them in chat I'm recording. <laughs> no legs. Hashtag grip. Oh freak. Everything is so slow. You just realized I'm a freaking air all air deck, so there's nothing he can do. Ha! Made him waste a bunch of elixir. Nice. Right here, you can do a little mini push with a baby dragon and a hog rider. <laughs> that literally almost took out his whole tower. I hate the cowboys. Nah, I'm just joking. I, I don't like them. I don't hate them, though. <laughs> Never let your elixir get full. Right there, I was just stargazing, not paying attention like usual. The last time you seen that card. Yeah, he has that. Please, smack her. Oh, freak. Why did that sound so wrong when I... Oh, crap. Cycle. I need to cycle. That tower's gone. 
Well played. That was a great zap. But it's my turn. He forgets I'm a Lava Hound pusher, which is great because then people hate Lava Hound. This is an intense match! <sighs> I'm trying. Come on! I can do it! Yes! Get that tower! That's what I thought! Woo! Intense match. The intensity is freaking real. Oh, that's that might be an ending push right there. Thanks! Yes! Okay. I gotta get enough for I gotta get the hound push up. Oh no. Yes! Okay, 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 okay. Come on, come on. I can get this. Come on! Yes! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Perfect book example why this deck is a beast. Anyway, uh, <laughs> wait, hold up. Wow. <laughs> Perfect example, why? <laughs> Rip English. Anyways guys, thank you guys for watching. If you like to see more content, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you like to see more content, and if also if you want to see another deck or you want me to tell you show you how to make some decks, I you just ask me and I'll make sure I'll try to make some decks so you can guys figure out anyone. Anyway guys, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.